Let's play! Hey guys, and welcome to my XMB. You might be wondering, Tanner, why are you here? Are you doing another Let's Demo? No, because what we're doing is, is since my um, Moemon LP will have to wait a little bit because it's, um, I have to re-record it a bit. So we're going to be doing a Let's Play of, that's right, Sonic Adventure for the PS3, Xbox 360, Dreamcast, and GameCube. Um, now, so this is not the DX version, um, mainly because it costs an extra $5 to uh, get the DX version. So, um, there won't be any unlockable Game Gear games, or unlockable Metal Sonic, or Mission Mode. Um, but you know what? It's Sonic, and Sonic is Sonic, and Sonic, this is probably either, this is probably my second favorite Sonic game. And so I'll leave you guys with the opening cutscene, which is, um, frightened me. Uh, it frightened me as a little child because of how A, awesome, and B, realistic it was. Or, uh, well, not really realistic, because, well, this was, this was the era of the N64, so... To this day, that opening gives me chills. Um, so yes, this is Sonic Adventure. We are playing on the... With my PS3. So, um, yeah. File. I'm going to go create a new file, because that's what the cool kids do. I'm just gonna turn on my volume. Jeez, it's loud. And so we have a choice. Well, later we will. Adventure or Trial. Adventure is story mode. Trial is time trials. So as you start off, you have... I'll go through the characters. Sonic. He's blue. He runs fast. Everybody knows Sonic. He's just one cool hedgehoggy guy. Yeah. Here we have Tails, Sonic's best friend. A fox with two tails who can fly. For in... I think he's... Eight years old. For an eight-year-old, he's amazing with contraptions and such. Here we have Knuckles, Sonic's 18-year-old uh, friend who is an echidna. A rival to Sonic, he can uh, glide with his knuckles for some reason, and is just a. Uh, he's pretty cool. He's a pretty cool guy. Here we have Amy, Sonic's self-proclaimed girlfriend. She is a pink hedgehog, who is um. She, uh, he, Sonic rescued her at the end of Sonic CD from uh, Metal Sonic. And here we have Big the Cat. Big the Cat is voiced by... Oh, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> big the Cat is voiced by Duke Nukem. And he is a big cat who likes fishing and his best friend is Froggy. And we'll get into E102 Gamma later. He's um, a little bit different. But we're five minutes in and there's nothing happening. So let's get started. And here's Station Square. This is an adventure field. Adventure fields are just hub worlds. 
Uh, it's a pretty peaceful looking city. People walking around, everything's completely normal. And lol at all times is now offline. You're gonna see a couple of things like that, because it's on the PS3, but whatever. Feel free to go and spam them. And here we have Sonic doing running on walls and jumping and stuff that you can't actually do in game. Oh, yeah. this is happening. Totally way past radical, man! And those cars don't seem to follow physics, but whatever. What's up? Something to totally not past awesome over there, dude. We gotta go check this chin dig up, man. You are completely surrounded. Surrender yourself. Oh yes, talk to the water monster. He'll listen to you. Guns in a Sonic game? Oh my. And the little pieces of corn fall to the ground. Oh no! Oh no, your acting is horrible. And here we go, guys. We have our first boss of the game. We're not even in. We don't even know the controls, and we're thrown into a boss battle with Chaos Zero. Not to be confused with the Zero from Kirby. This boss is rather easy. You jump into him. Or you can homing attack into him. That's what I prefer doing. The controls are rather easy. The action button, which in our case is X, may change for other systems, allows you to jump. If you press it again in midair, you'll do a thing called a homing attack, which lets you basically lock on to an enemy. If you hold uh, another button, I think it's called the sub button, you'll charge up for the, um, the spin hey, attack. You, um, you can also pick up objects with this. And yeah, 28 seconds. Here, yeah, we totally rocked in. We got some rings. Rings can be used for a very special minigame later, which I will be showing because I love this minigame. I've devoted... Heck, the only reason I really on, bought this game drip. was for that minigame. He called him a big drip. Get it? Oh, 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 oh. It's funny because drip relates to water. And, yeah. You know nothing, fool. It's chaos. The god of destruction! <laughs> oh look, it is a very portly looking wal wal blah, walrus guy. That is Dr. Eggman. He is the villain of this game. Um, or Dr. Robotic. Either Eggman. Well, no. His name is Dr. Ivo. Bra uh, quote, Eggman, unquote, Robotnik. Huh? His nickname's Eggman. It's... And it's generally accepted to be his uh, Tails? nickname, or even his Watch first out. name. You're gonna crash. Ah. Oh, Sonic has fangs there. Oh my! Tails. Vibration. Oh, what am I gonna do with you? Please don't say that. Please, all the fan girls have way too many answers for that. And hi, suddenly bikini girl. Why, hello there. Oh, very nice. I uh, how you doing? Hmm, yeah. I'll show you my spin it, my spin dash. Yeah. A plane crashed over there at the beach. I hope the pilot's okay. Mr. Sonic, please go see if you can save him. Uh, maybe later. Hello there, little kid. I'm Mr. Know It All. Here's a clue. Grab these spinning rings. It's important. As long as you, uh, we all know this. I've already told them that. I already told them that. Ah. Okay, guys, so in the next part, we are going to go to uh, the first level of the game, which is Emerald Coast. And I shall see you guys next time. Bye. Whee! Whoa, Nelly. Sonic's gone drunk. Uh, 
I swear I only had one drink, officer. Only one drink. Oh, 